Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Siriana Tarot. This is going to be an energy check-in love reading for my dearest Taurus. Taurus, we're going to take a look at the person most on your mind or your current situation. And if these messages resonate with you, I am going to ask that you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So let's get started. Let's see what clear messages and guidance come through for my dearest Taurus for their highest and greatest good. All right, so we already have the Six of Pentacles coming through as your overall energy. Your person is showing up as the Hermit in reverse, a Virgo, a Virgo energy. All right, they're viewing you as the Ace of Pentacles. What you're not seeing is the Empress, and we also have the Fool, okay, all almost all showing up in reverse. All right, so I am hearing fools rush in here, Taurus, so you do want to be careful. Um, you may hear or find out some triggering information about why things didn't work out with this person, and it feels like it's there's a real possibility that this person may have been juggling or there's some sort of third-party interference. We have the Hierophant card coming out in reverse, which is, I'm sorry, as the overall energy in the upright, <laughs> which is your energy telling me that you are in alignment, that you're on the right path. This person is going to most likely surprise you with the truth or yeah, because of the hermit card in reverse, or, or they're just going to kind of show up out of nowhere. And it might be a little triggering for you because this really could be somebody who ghosted, or this could be somebody who, yeah, who, who broke up with you. Um, out of nowhere, something like that. But I do feel with the Six of Pentacles, what you're looking for is coming towards you. And for a lot of you, it's, it's not this person. Um, again, you could be dealing with a Virgo, a, another Taurus, or a Libra here, an Aries as well. But it's more of an energy read than a signs read. So what you're looking for is looking for you, Taurus, Six of Pentacles. Now, it is possible for some of you, this person's going to try to come in and make it up to you. Um, but they do, they are looking at you as a missed opportunity with the Ace of Pentacles there in reverse. Yeah, see, I think this person was breadcrumbing you, was ignoring you. Spirit's telling you that you want to pay attention to red flags here when this, when this energy comes towards you. Yeah, you're in alignment, Taurus. This person was wish-washy. This person was juggling. Um, They're going to try to come back in, and I feel like it is going to be triggering for you, but I feel like Spirit's saying, stay the course. Stay the course. Yeah, this is going to be triggering for you. This person has been in their head about you. They've been, most likely that's ego energy, because most likely a lot of my Taurus, you're no longer giving to this connection, or you cut them off when you started to see red flags, or maybe this person ghosted you and you didn't chase them. All right, yeah, something has ended for this person, and that's why they're coming towards you. So some sort of third-party situation has ended, and I'm not going to lie, Taurus, for a lot of you, it is with somebody else. And I feel like a lot of you, you know, they may have been juggling. I feel like this person was most likely doing you dirty. All right, now for some of you, third-party stuff can be friends or family, responsibilities, work. But really, I'm reading this Empress energy in reverse as another person. And this person, they're coming back around because it didn't work out with that other person. And they're going to try to make it work with you. All right. And we see, yep, this person knows that, they, that they've disappointed you, that they hurt you. Um, and yeah, this person knows that you have options or that the choice is going to be yours if you're going to even hear them out. To be honest, Taurus, again, I, I heard fools rush in. Don't rush into anything here with this person. I do think they're going to come in quite charming. They're going to lay it on thick. They're probably going to plan something special. I would be very, very careful. This Empress energy in reverse is saying there's a hidden third party or there was, and it may not be completely over. So this person might be having difficulties with somebody else or, you know, maybe somebody else has, you know, picked up on them being a player or just not pulling their weight in the relationship. Yeah, this person, this person keeps too many secrets, Taurus. So I do feel you have every right to be a bit triggered when this person comes in. I don't think they've done right by you. Uh, I feel this is a confirmation reading. It's like Spirit's just showing me here with this Hierophant card and the Six of Pentacles that what you're looking for is coming towards you, but most likely it's somebody else. Yep, you need to protect your energy from this person and it's time to move on. Yeah, see, you have, things are going to be getting easier for you, Taurus, in your love life, but I feel this is absolutely a karmic situation. 
that you needed to or you need to let go of. All right, so let's see. Any general ad advice or guidance, please, for my Taurus? General advice or guidance, please, for my Taurus. Yeah, it's time to stop the pattern. Maybe you had an off and on with this person. For some of you, maybe they gave you the silent treatment um, or they just ghosted. That's kind of what I'm getting. Yeah, it's time for somebody new. Yeah, it's time to leave this past player in the, in the dust, Taurus. And a lot of you, hopefully you already have. Hopefully they're long gone. All right, yeah, this person is definitely going to take a leap of faith or a risk. So that's the choice you're going to have because they are going to try to reinitiate things. But, you know, it's kind of outdated, um, you know, and I feel like you've been in your head about this connection. I kind of feel like Spirit's advice is to just no longer entertain this energy. It's time to move on. It's time to protect your energy. You've been dealing with somebody silly, foolish, a player, somebody who just definitely wasn't doing right by you. But you do have this, you have some sort of higher level of commitment coming towards you. Okay, so it. Well, let's see who this person might be. So who is this new energy coming towards my Taurus? Somebody who owns their own business. They could be a Libra, all right? Somebody where fairness and harmony in relationships is important to them. And they could have Capricorn in their chart as well. So somebody who works hard, they're stable, you know, that's their priority. They can be relied upon. And they may have Leo energy in their chart, or just they're going to be fun, positive, passionate, playful. They're going to be strong. They're going to be resilient. So this is the energy that you need to focus on or that you should focus on, Taurus. Again, this past person, you know, we already spent too much time on them, um, but they are coming back around. This new person has lost a loved one within the last year. And for a lot of you, this person's going to be from overseas or just a different cultural background. They may have an imperfection in their speech. Most likely they speak one or multiple or multiple languages, two or multiple languages. And this is somebody who's stable. They own their own home here, Taurus. All right, so let's see. Clear messages and guidance. Clear messages and guidance. All right, so Spirit wants you to know that the universe is talking to you. Pay attention to signs and clues. I also feel like it's just a confirmation of this reading. Somebody out there needs to hear it. Um, and you have a new connection coming towards you that's going to be stable, but it's also going to be very transformative and very healing. All right, so Taurus, I'm going to leave it there. I'm sending you so much love and light. If these messages do resonate, don't forget to hit that like button, share, subscribe. Check out the description box for ways you can get a private reading or if you like the cards I'm using or if you want to follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Love and light. Take care.